my favorite, my favorite submission, you know, is the Kimura. And my favorite spot to be as well is half guard top. So I'm going to show you some techniques that uh, we combine both that I really like to be on the half guard and work on the Kimura from there as well, which is a safe position to me, right? So let's go for the first one. We got on the half guard. Right, so, so to understand how I get to the Kimura, so when someone, when someone gets on the bottom on the half guard, he always wants to get the underhook. So for me, the best way to do would be underhook and cross face, right? Which is a hard thing to do because Michael is already in an angle. So for him to win the battle of the palm here, if it, it's easier for him to pommel in than it is for me to go around, all right? So I actually got tired to fight this battle here and then I started to go, I started to work with, with his underhook, right? So for example, he, come, he got the underhook and at the same time, he stops my, my cross face. So I start to work over the head. So every time I get on a half guard, I let him get the underhook, right? And, um, and when he gets the underhook, I go over, right? I go over his arm. I don't fight for the cross face. And what you have to understand is where I'm gonna place my armpit. Because if I place my armpit too high, he still has a very strong underhook. So when I go with my armpit, I go very close to his elbow. So what I do is first I go over his elbow, over his shoulder, close to his elbow, and then I push with my weight. So when he goes down, I switch to the side. But you see my arm, it's in between his elbow and his shoulder. If I come too high, it's, he will be strong here. So I get super close here. Right, so all my weight's on his arm. One way to, like sometimes they hide, you know, they worry about the Kimura. One way that I do to, uh, to get the Kimura, I start to push the knee. That's everybody's natural reaction to try to push, to pull my arm. So I just swim under and then I get the Kimura, right? First things first, when I make a grip, I place on the mat because I want him far away from his, his gi and pants, so I keep on the mat, right? So here's, he gets weaker and it's harder for him to bring his arm back. At the same time, with my foot inside, I start to bring close to his butt, right? So I start to move his arm slowly up, his entire arm, all right? At the same time, I move forward and I wanna get my knee up, all right? So I fake, I go on the Kimura, I remove my leg. Once I remove my leg, I sprawl over his shoulder here. So my whole weight is on his shoulder, then I move his arm up, keep his hand on the mat, and I just turn to finish the Kimura. One more time. So he gets the underhook, I go over the arm, push it down, get on my side. Push the knee, grab the Kimura, bring to the, to the floor, move up, the same time I move, move my body up, Escape my leg, sprawl over his shoulder, keep his hand on the mat, and finish the Kimura.